A social media trend behind some recent pellet gun shootings. That's what police in Nassau and Suffolk are looking into. They want to know if those shootings are linked to a TikTok challenge. News 12 Long Island's Christopher King, live in Deer Park, where a 13 year old girl was shot. Christopher. Doug, one of those shootings happened right here at the Tanger Mall. Police say someone opened fire with a pellet gun on a young girl. Shoppers we speak with now wonder is anywhere safe? News 12 first showed you this disturbing video. Take a look. A car drives by. Police say someone opens fire with an airsoft gun on this man as he walks down the street. You are really shocked. It happened Monday afternoon on Deer Park Avenue in North Babylon. Police say earlier that day, someone used a pellet gun to shoot a 12 year old girl in the parking lot at the Tanger Mall in Deer Park. I didn't realize they have one here. Kim Rodafon heard about the attacks. Very disappointing. She didn't know one happened here at the mall. It's very disturbing. The same day, a car drives by and someone fires a pellet gun at two men in Levittown. Police say it's one of four incidents in Nassau County. That's uncalled for. Police in Nassau and Suffolk now investigating if the shootings are related to a TikTok challenge. It's sad, it's sad. Nancy Nunez says social media may have too much influence over young people. They go to social media to follow what they're seeing. It's real disturbing. She now worries about her young son's safety. It's hard to think that you could walk anywhere and just have to watch yourself anywhere. No arrests so far. It's unclear if the incidents in Nassau and Suffolk County are at all connected. We're live in Deer Park. Christopher King, News 12, Long Island.